Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Spoolie here back for another video. Um, I feel like everybody wants to know how to get the best sensitivity and I am like tired of looking at people's, you know, the other videos are just trash, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, yeah, they may be famous people or whatever and they may pop off with their fan base and stuff like that and I'm probably one of the most irrelevant YouTubers ever. But if you find this video, this will help. I have a brand new account right now just for this video, sub, like, and comment. And what's gonna happen is, I'm gonna show you, the only, the only, only thing you need is this map right here, okay? So, um, public, private, doesn't really make a difference. What we're gonna do, I'm gonna show you how to get the best sensitivity, okay? It's a fresh new account, I have it modified. No, this is just for controller, I'm sure you can do it for PC too, but, um, I mean, keep it a mouse, but, I'm going to show you on controller how to get the best, best version of sensitivity for yourself. Now, this is an edit aim course for peace control and all that stuff, but it also could be used for finding your sensitivity, which people probably don't know about. So, I'm going to show you. All right, the map is loading. He wants you to support him. Use code SPLEE in your item shop instead. Well, first thing you want to go first is people say, how am I going to get, like, my building isn't fluent and all that stuff. How are you going to get the best building? The first thing you need to do is don't worry about building. Worry about aim. Because your aim is going to throw off your how your building is. Oh, God. What the hell? So, this is without even modifying anything this is how do people play this when they first get on the game by default oh my god look how slow it is it's terrible <laughs> anyway so that's beside the point but anyway yeah free builds good on stuff first thing you want to go to the main portion of this is this shotgun aim okay so you don't want to worry about this crap um we're gonna go to the 360 version okay so this is how, I'm not going to modify anything, you can see how bad, you know, you start off here, and I already know I need a higher sensitivity, but just start as low, like, like lower than you think you can, and then, so, look up, my reaction time is terrible. it's not that bad for the aim part but it's not I, I, I know what I can talk about but anyway as you can see I'm missing a shot and I'm not as consistent so now we're gonna go into the settings now dang what did they put on this thing okay so anyway advanced control make sure that's on um, so now so this is this is what the fault looks like okay. I really don't like it. Oh, it's anyway, so we're not worried about that. Now, we'll go to, let's just start with, let's start with 30. This stuff is zero. care about the aim down ADS. So let's start 30-30, okay? Just try, try to make it so you can, like, they're hard shots. Like, don't just, like, sit here and go. Don't do that. Literally, just try. 360. It's too slow. So, I, I already, like, maybe I should have used my account for this in the first place, to be honest with you. Settings feel weird, the vibration on, I don't play with vibration anymore. Bring it 
back memory though. But you can see we're getting a little bit more consistent with our shots. It takes forever to turn around, so you'd be dead in a heartbeat. So anyway, we're gonna adjust that again. Um, now everyone's settings are gonna be a little bit different, but you gotta, you gotta, you gotta really pick and choose what you feel. Perfect. So once you get this aim out of the way, everything else will be smooth sailing. Now I'm getting a little bit better. So we're gonna change this to 40. Well, we'll do 50. Cause that's probably gonna be too fast. Now we know we're in the middle of something. A little bit too fast. So now we're going to go down to 45, or maybe we should go a little bit down to 47. It's not too slow, it might not be too fast. pre-firing. Well, you can see how much more consistent I am. And I say that. Now we're going to go down to 43. Because we tried 47 with that. Down 3 from 50. And now we're going to go up 3 from 40. See if it's a little slow. Not my cup of tea. I still feel a little slow. So now we're going to try and go 45. And this is usually what I play with, so I think this will be perfect. But we're not. Trying to free fire them before that little thing goes away, like the, the, around their body. That's how you do it fast. You're trying to do it really fast. All right. So now that we got the aim down. Because I feel. You may fail a different thing with a different setting. Now that we got the aim down. Now we'll go back. Now we'll go into free build. Okay, so now we have our setting. So now we can just modify from here. Okay, this is obviously too slow. Like, really slow. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to try 1.5. Not bad, but it's still too slow for my liking. 
The goal is to drastically change it so that way you do not feel like you don't notice a difference. So, it's still slow. For my liking. So now, we're going to go to... We don't want to go right to 2.0 because it might feel okay and it's less room to... Which I call. So we're going to go to 2.5 because we know that's going to be too fast for us. We already know it's going to be too fast. So we know this is not what, what, what is comfortable to us. But boy, I can get used to that. I guess you can. But, uh... You know. It is what it is. I would do what's comfortable and not something you have to get used to. So, now we know to go down. We'll go to 2.3. We don't want to go down too far because we, we we want to be able to go just below too fast and just under too slow. Or no, I'm sorry, just under too fast and and just over too slow. So now we're doing the free build. So now we feel our settings starting to come together. I still feel like it's a little fast, not going to lie. So we are going to go down to 1.9 on both. I feel like there's a little resistance. Meaning that there, it's just too slow. Because I can feel it now. Like I feel, I feel a little tiny resistance. So it's going to be higher than this. So now we're going to go to 2.1. Which is nice. It feels great. Well, not necessarily. It doesn't feel perfect. But you will feel in the game. Like, you can't see much of a difference. Because I'm still doing the same edits over and over again. But you can feel it when you're playing. You know? A, a little resistance. You feel like you're dragging. You feel like you're too stiff. Or you're too, like, all over the place. <clears throat> so, I'm going to have to say that... These are close to finding my perfect settings. Yep, I don't know. I don't think I don't. Th I, I think it needs to be adjusted to two point build mode and two point edit mode. We're focusing on the the build speed. We're yeah. I'm doing the edits and stuff. Don't worry about the edits yet. The edits are the last thing to check. We want to see. How, like, you know, spinning in circles speed. We want, we want to see if that feels okay. Forget the edits. Just see where the crosshair placement is for when you're building. Unfortunately, this is where it gets tricky. You gotta understand not to confuse what your builds for your edits because people like I think it's my edits are too slow stop you oh you're naturally by brain your brain is just gonna naturally think that this is not the right settings for you based off that you gotta focus on like let's say you're getting shot at you gotta be focused on doing this oh god does this feel comfortable to you don't worry about the edits like I said all that will matter in a, matter, matter in a bit like, how, how does it feel? Can you do your tunnels feeling, like, good? Like, 
Who cares if you miss edits? That's the point. It's all about seeing this. I feel like this could be a little faster. Just a tad bit. Like one notch up for builds. So I'm actually going to think that it actually is 2.1. Now. The edit speed. You want accurate edits. You don't want to, to, to really fast edits. You just want you want to make sure you're... It's easy to control your crosshair. So you're really focused. You want to really focus on accuracy on your crosshair placement. You know? So now we're on edits. Because this feels good now. A little, I get shot at. Oh, turn around. Feels good now. Now it feels great. So we want to focus on edits. So do the same technique. Go to something you know is too slow, like 1.5. It's not super bad, but I feel a huge, like, pull trying to do this. It looks better than it feels, trust me. I could not play on this. My crosshair placement, it's not that hard to get crosshair placement, but it just feels so stiff. So you don't want that. So now, we're going to go to 1.7. We're going to go up a little bit. We're just going to feel for it a little bit. Don't worry about the cool edits I do or basic edits I do. We just want to see where the crosshair placement is on our on our um, builds. We want to focus on that and what feels comfortable. Oh, got a box on. You know. It's, does it feel like it's dragging or does it feel like it's like going all over the place and you can't control it be honest with yourself only if you're honest with yourself then will it actually help you and benefit you and who cares if you don't look slow and look like a fast keyboard sweat that's fine the goal is to get the perfect settings for who you are as a person. You're not trying to look like Raider 464. You're really not. So. <clears throat> Personally. Everything is fine, but this. I feel, I feel a pull. I feel a pull when I do this. I don't like it. When I'm doing that little edit down like that, I feel a tiny pull. So we're gonna actually go down, go up to 2.1.8. You gotta, don't look at, oh, I'm missing edits. This can't be the right setting. Don't do that. Cause you will adapt and get used to doing the same edit on the setting over and over and over again. It's how it feels while your camera is moving and the game is going. That's how you know when you found your right settings. I would have to say that the best feeling one was under 2.1. I would say it's probably 1.9 and this is how it would be. That was just a misclick. Just basically what I'm saying is just adjust accordingly. You know, you don't have to, it doesn't have to feel perfect. But if it continues to feel weird, your reflexes are too fast or too slow for whatever you're, whatever you're, however you're playing. So 
you got to make sure you do some stuff like this just to get just to get ready. Like you will find the, if you you will find the perfect sentence doing what I just said. The next part is we're gonna do the peace control thing just to see, just to see. You know, it's whatever. It's not like the best peace control map to practice, but. So now you have your aim down, which is fine. And then you got, you know, your buildings feeling a little bit better. Test it out. Test, test, test your movement out. Just practice it. I mean, you're not really trying to clip the bot, but you're just trying to warm up your fingers to the sensitivity that you just found for yourself. You gotta register in your brain that whatever sensitivity you were playing before, or if you're new to the game, that you feel like you can compete against really good, really good players. It's not about really practicing your peace control, it's just to simulate a small fight. That obviously you should win every time. You shouldn't lose this fight, but... Well, anyway, this is the process I used to get my sensitivity. It's definitely wrong. It is not the right settings. But anyway, after you find your perfect settings, let's just pretend I did. Okay. Let's just pretend I did, because we're... I'm not trying to sit here for an hour to find settings on a different account when I have my own settings on my other account, my actual account, and I don't want to confuse my brain, so we're just, that's enough for that. Um, now, the next portion is you want to get into as many fights as you possibly can, PvP fights. So we're going to go to Browse, we're going to go to Practice, we're going to go to Bios Respawn Royale, Public Game. The only thing I don't like is you get boosts in this game now, but it'll simulate as many fights as possible. Like, that guy had a boost on him, he just died. Oh my god, imagine. So, just work on their new settings, practice your tunnels, simulate end games for you. It's got some lame weapons in it, and you know, people play really weird for no reason, but you know, it's okay. At the end of the day, it's gonna help you get used to your sensitivity that you spend so hard on to find. There you go. See, see, as you can see, I got now I got some kind of lane boost. I mean, yeah, I guess it's fine if you're pub stomping and whatever, but if you're trying to actually practice, it's kind of lame, honestly. So then you're gonna run into play into the tilted zone where it's names off. Don't put names on. That takes no skill. You don't have to you you know wall hacking people and stuff like that. I mean you can do what you want, but if you want a feel of an actual game, this is it. Now there's no respawn and you gotta wait around and you gotta play smart. And this is where the sweats. I mean I did run into a lot of bots in here too, but this is where all the sweats play. So that's good. Alright, as I said before, um, this is where like a lot of sweats play. There's a lot of bots in here too, so it's a little mixture of both. Um, what you want to do is you start off with loot. I mean, it's got old loot, but it's also got some good loot. I mean, new loot. I'm sorry, new loot in the game from the uh, 
new season, so you gotta you gotta make sure you practice as much as you can with those weapons. You can get your third party in, third party aim in, and stuff like that. This is your ultimate test, and then if you really want to test yourself after this, you go play arena, and that'll be how you find your ultimate sensitivity. I actually died to another bot. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's over, it's over, it's over, it's over, guys, it's over. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please, please, slap this thumbs up. It was very painful. Very, very painful to do this video. I ain't gonna lie. Because, uh, I didn't find the right sensitivity. I, but I think it has something to do with there's little... The, the settings I didn't mess with is kind of screwing it up, um, to be honest with you. I don't think it was, it's something wrong with the sensitivity that I changed. I think it's something wrong with the sensitivity that I haven't changed. Like, some of the stuff I didn't change. Like, the boosts and all that stuff. So, I, I think that might be it. But, nonetheless, if you guys did enjoy this, use creator code SPULIA in your item shop.